Hi guys, um, so as you can see I just posted a video of some of the events that took place last night. We were in the winter meetings of the Joe Randoms Fantasy League and uh, we happened to have the privilege of being in the presence of Mr. Michael Caldwell, Mr. Drew Paz, Mr. Andrew Thayer, Mr. Braden Dunford, and Mr. Burnett Sucks. So there was a lot of uh, discussion about what we should do with our league funding, the Caldwell Fine, Anthem Joe Random, etc. All these things. And Mr. Michael Caldwell was not very fond of the Caldwell Fine, uh, as you would imagine. And the reasoning was, you know, why do we need to tax? That was his reason. We shouldn't have to penalize finishing for 10, 10th or 9th or 8th even. Uh, that was also discussed. But figured we need funds for the league we need to cover for trophies um, t-shirts potentially although Caldwell does not think that's a necessity but it's in we can do that so trophies t-shirts draft day expenses etc so we're gonna devise a budget plan and we're gonna hire an accountant to keep track of all this stuff so mr. Andrew Thayer will be our serving accountant as of now, unless anybody wants to run or oppose him in an election. But he has offered his accounting uh, prowess and will help us with this. I will put together the expenses of our league in as long as I can remember and will do the best that I can so we can get an accurate depiction of what our funds look like, what they've been looking like and what they should look like in the future. So. Here is the new proposal. I need votes from everybody, everybody in every league, um, and it's going to be one vote per team, one vote per team, in in um, yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, it'll be discussed. Here we go. So, this proposal called the Caldwell Fee, proposed by Michael Caldwell. Owner of Prestige Worldwide, Keyboard Warrior, and the Caldwell Fine. Necessary. A proposed financial plan with necessary debt surplus info, league expenses, future league expenses to evaluate current and future financial status. Okay. The proposition. Pending a necessary adjustment to financial plan to and compensate for financial necessities, a mandatory $10 fee will be required of each league's team owners. The fee will be dis divided when applicable for multiple co-owners. This equates to a $30 fee for a three league member or a three league system per owner. A generation of $100, 10 teams at $10 per league would be more than adequate for finances. All fees will be required at a predetermined date prior to the baseball draft, which is the first draft of the calendar year. Under this plan, a deterrent fine for the last place team shall not be enacted as the compensation for each league will be sufficient. Signed, Michael E. Caldwell, December 13, 2014. Okay. So, hope you understood that. Basically, the proposal, it scratches the Caldwell fine. Not that we had it in the first place, but it eliminates the Caldwell fine. And along with this plan, it's not written in here, but it also means with the trophy fees, instead of having an insurance policy, it means that the policy will be you break it, you buy it. Okay? So. That's there wouldn't be any insurance fees and now yes we've had two broken trophies as we do but since we did not have the break it buy it policy in place before the two broken trophy owners will not be responsible for paying the replacing the trophy fee however these league funds that would be required from each league's team so like we said, the $10 uh, for each team in each league, so 100 100 100 that money would be 
what funds the new trophies okay unless you break it you buy it from now on so the first year and we do this you know we're gonna have a better idea of how our funding actually works and where we need the money so at the end of 2015 we'll print up our our budget statement and we'll see what we actually use what we needed what we need more of whatever it might be but this is gonna get this would get us jump started it would get us it would get the league funds trophies cover draft day expenses etc now the other thing that I did not mention is what we will be voting on is you either vote for this plan you can vote against this plan or what we're going to do is there are going to be three options. Like I said, you can vote against it completely. You can be for it. However, Caldwell does not think t-shirts are a necessity. If we did this plan, the $10 per team, $100 a league, would include t-shirt fees for the championship team. Okay? On the flip side, you can also vote on this plan with a five dollar fee for each team so it'd be fifty dollars each league but it would be without t-shirts so it, you get it all in one you get it all in one you either get with t-shirts ten dollars a team each league and it would be an inaugural fee every year so thirty teams if you're thirty dollars if you're in three leagues twenty if you're in two leagues 10 if you're in one, if you're in a duo ownership, you can split it. And every whatever you want to do, every franchise operates their business differently. But yeah, that's the deal. So 10 with t-shirts, 5 without t-shirts. I'm going to put this poll up and uh, we need we need everybody to vote. This directly affects your future. Thank you very much. Please post any questions, comments, anything you may have and we'll try to get back to you as soon as we can. Thank you very much.